You never know what you'll find in the universe of my mind. His name is Fred, and he's living in his new homestead. He's a daydream come true. Now let's see what he's up to. Be a good day for your first driving lesson today, Fred, don't you think? You all set? Excuse me, miss. Ah! Are you aware you have a skeleton driving your car? Uh, that's kind of the point. He's having a driver's lesson. Huh. Uh, as a responsible citizen, I'm afraid this may be a matter of public safety. Who says? Well, luckily, I'm a certified backseat driving instructor. Oh! Uh, I see. Um. All right. All right, Mr. Skeleton. Let's get started. Yeah! Where are your feet? Uh, yeah, one foot on the floor at all times. Unless you see a trick-or-treater. Then both feet on the gas. <laughs> That'll scare them. <laughs> yeah. Hands ten and two. <clears throat> That's more like nine and four. A lazy four. I thought a skeleton could tell better time than that. Oh, I know. Just put, uh, put your hands two hours before and after witching hour. Good. All right, let's do a couple of pre-drive safety checks. That's good on you. Check. Pretty good day for for your lesson today. I think you're doing great. All right, as your lights are past, well, they're only on half the time, but that just means we'll have to settle for being half as hazardous. <laughs> Got that, student driver? Okay, let's get on the road. Ignition. That foot on the brake. Check your mirror. Gear in reverse. Twist and look over your right shoulder. Uh, what? Your vertebrae are fused from laying in a coffin for 30 years and you can't turn your head far enough? Sorry, I can't certify you to drive this car. What? There, there. They said the same thing to me when they found out my paws don't reach the pedals. Oh, dear, dear. 